Cue the love music. Cue the love songs. Rainer! Honey, I'm home! Okay. Zagara, have the Leviathan stabilize this section of the ship. That's true, Big Dodo. That is correct. I was too lazy today. It is done. Hold on, Jim. I'm Hold on, Jimmy. Here. I'm here. Do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Here she comes! Much like Mario and Luigi, Carrigan and Jimmy are finally alone. <gasps> Wait, is that a bug or a feature? Many guys in the chat will be, yes! More tentacles? <laughs> Tell that to Phoenix. <laughs> Tell it to the millions you butchered. You swore you'd kill the Queen of Blades. This is very romantic. Whoever believed in me. Dude, that is one hell of a gun. If he fires that over here, his ears are dead. I don't know much about guns, but a tiny little cell and a gun that big? Don't do it! You're gonna destroy your- Okay. Okay. Jimmy just hears- That's- that's all he hears right now. I love you, Jim. Permanent tinnitus. Never forget it. We're done. Damn, dude. They are no longer Facebook official. Yeah. He's cold, not even a hug. Why does he have a gun in the prison? Hmm. Why, yeah, why was he in the cell? I mean, there are so many plot holes in this storyline that I hadn't even considered that one. He also had his cigarettes and everything still with him. I don't really know how that works. Hmm. Yeah, maybe that's just a currency. You have unselected abilities, my queen. You can review them within your... If you look carefully, and you will have to look very carefully right now, but if you look carefully in the distance, there's a gigantic battle cruiser hanging in the background. Yeah. I'm just pointing it out because I feel like many of you would have missed it. Your power level has increased. A new tier of You're welcome, Chad. <laughs> you don't see it anywhere? All right, all right, well... All combat ground units spawn brutlings on death equal to twice their supply cost. <laughs> what? That's insanely strong. All combat air units spawn two scourge on death. Brutlings ignore half of their targets' as armor. Infested marines have increased movement speed. Okay. Start each mission with a free infested command center. Morphing infested planetary fortresses and orbital commands costs nothing and occurs 100% faster. Infested planetary fortresses gain plus two range. And scanner sweep costs 50% less energy. All casters start with maximum energy, have 100% increased energy regeneration, and a 50% maximum energy. Dude, all casters? I'm a caster. I would like to start with additional energy every day. I feel like I have quite a bit of energy already, but... More? Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with the parasitic infusion though, because this sounds really fun. This allows me to really be the swarm. Yeah, these are massive bonuses. We 
We are picking up a strange psionic signal. It is Zerg in origin, but not part of the swarm. I know you seek to topple Manx, his alien soldiers. The Who do you think that is? Your greatest threat. If you wish to stop them, meet me at these coordinates. If the Dominion is controlling hybrid, our invasion of Korhal will fail. I've no idea, man. There's an infestation specialist. It can take control of enemy units. Also is able to immobilize units while it deals area damage to large groups. It is known as the unclean one. Ooh, all right. All right. That's me. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. We have the Primal Viper, a flying offensive caster. Can cast up Dark Blinding Cloud, Consume, and Parasitic Bomb. Damn, dude. Imagine that in a multiplayer. That would be so insane. Imagine one flying unit for the Zerg that can cast Abduct, Blinding Cloud, Consume, and Parasitic Bomb. That's ridiculous. And now we have the Torresk. Heavy Assault Unit cleaves uh, ground targets with an area damage attack and roar to fear nearby. Okay. That would be insane, man. Yeah. Inconceivable. We are rawr to intimidate. <laughs> rawr XD. Don't be alarmed. This is only temporary. This isn't just about getting rid of the hybrid threat, is it? Why are you helping me? They held me here for many years. I... Okay. The unclean one. We must dislodge this I force. should probably switch over to the other new ability thing that I just unlocked, but I'm lazy. I don't want to do it. Unclean one? A lot of you seem to relate to this unit called the unclean one. Why is that, chat? Do you want to talk about it? It's a Discord moderator's defining feature? Yeah. Loco TV hirings take place based exclusively off of the amount you shower each week. Now, that may be an inappropriate question to ask, but... Um, Devouring Plague infects all enemy units and buildings in the targeted area, inflicting 300 damage over 20 seconds. Cannot reduce units or life below one, or units or buildings below one life, ignores shields and reveals infected cloak units. And then there is Parasitic Domination. Very nice. Embed a parasite in the targeted unit, fully restoring their vitals and rendering them under your control for two minutes. When the duration expires, the parasite will burrow into the host's brain, killing them instantly. Do you think I have one of those in my head right now? There's a chance. And then we have Consume. Kills the target a friendly unit. The caster gains 1.5 energy per point of life. Hmm. Very, very good. You shower twice a day, Big Dodo? Dang, dude. It burns! So it doesn't kill it. Oh, you guys have a basic attack? Ah, of course. It's kind of like High Templar, but then, you know, minus the High Templar part. Dominion garrisons will periodically spawn infantry to attack your bases while gas is being vented onto the platform. Infest them to prevent this from happening. Devourer and Brood Guardian mutations are now available at the Spire. Assimilating the Zerg Brutes present on Char, Zeras and Kaldir has increased Kerrigan's control of the swarm, raising the maximum supply cap to 250. 250? Very nice. Can now move on. The viral phase Dominate it. The oh, I can just. An 
Dude, the fact that this thing has so much HP just by itself. I should have rapid fire on hotkey V. So you guys can just... Oh, you guys also outrange bunkers. Ah, of course. Some of these units are pretty powerful, guys. Loki, did you ever have a shower beer? No, no, no. I've never had a shower beer in my life. Some guys in the chat claim that you haven't lived until shower beer, but... Yeah, I prefer drinking gravy in the shower. Or yogurt. Another shower favorite in the loco household. Barbecue sauce? Absolutely. But only if we're out of garlic. Garlic sauce OP. Shower fajitas. <laughs> Shower fajitas. That's amazing. I agree. No, I'm not sold on shower beers, if I'm being honest with you guys. Can I have a base? I would like to have a base now. That's because you've never tried it? I feel like shower- you guys make it sound like shower beers are a very common thing. Oh my god. Brood Guardians. So these things... Shower beers are not that common, dude. There's no way. So these guys... Whoa, dude! They're basically Tempest. But then they also shoot... Brutlings. Oh, I love these things already. They're my new favorite unit. How do I make more? I already have a hive. Yo, Alex! Saw your Warhammer figures on Instagram. Are you planning on paint some Tyranids? I did paint some Tyranids already, actually. That they come in the they came in a starter set that I bought. You wanna see them? Um one of the Tyranids I painted when I just got started, and then one like maybe a, three weeks ago. This is the nicer one. This is the nicer one that I'm pretty happy with. Um, but it's a tiny, tiny one though. I do really like the Tyranid models. I think this one turned out quite well. So I bought a starter set that came with a bunch of Space Marines and a bunch of Tyranids to like give this a try. And um, I really liked it. Yeah. This was the first model where I did a little bit of uh, edge highlighting. So on the carapace, I tried being as tidy as possible, but it's not that easy. But I think it turned out decently well, actually. Yeah. Yeah. But I I had to like reapply it about seventeen times now. Been a while since I caught a stream. Yo. Thanks for the content. Aaron, thank you so much, man. Casual three years. Thank you. Appreciate that. Is my army going to be one of everything? If I'm not careful, yes. But I'm gonna try and not let that happen. Because there's a lot of models that I would like to give a try, but I'm gonna continue painting some more... Uh, what are they called? Stormcast Eternals. I would get more, but it's kind of pricey, you know? So I was like, eh. Can't, can't like, you know. Can't buy everything I like. You think I will sample everything? Well, it's not just the cost of the models. I also don't have that much of the paint, you know? I also need a bunch of paints. What does this ability do? 
Let's see. Hurl or glob of acidic bile at the targeted location, dealing damage. Okay. Also three years. Yo! Thanks for all the content. Back to back three year resubs. Thank you very much, my half soul. I appreciate it. That is very generous of you. Hey, so this section of the map is actually open. This is very cursed. For some reason, it doesn't fit. Attack alongside the infested. Kill anyone in our way. Uh, I think I'm gonna put up a bunch of those swarm lurkers in important locations, so we don't get overwhelmed too much. Yeah, like these guys over here are dealing a lot of damage. And I will figure out how to do more of these big boys. Oh, I also now have... Devourers gain additional attack speed. Bombardments projectiles move three times as fast. It also spawns two infested marines. They get plus two range and spawn one additional brutling with their attack. What the heck? Let's... Yeah, let's... Sure. Okay. I'm gonna make a bunch of swarm lurkers, mostly just because I want to defend the choke points. But then uh, we'll transition away from it. Yeah, I need to have a bunch of them set up. Okay. Just to make sure that I don't randomly die, I guess. I will move this guy away. A little bit. Yeah, they're very, very heavy in supply, absolutely. But they're super powerful when it comes to defending choke points, so I don't think I really need that many. Okay, we'll make a few more of them. A couple of spines. I think I can actually also get some upgrades for the spine still, or maybe that is... Yeah. Extended reach. Yeah, we'll get some of those upgrades. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna go armor upgrades. Same for them, actually. I should really go armor upgrades. Okay. So you guys go over here. And I, should, I think this should, put me in a, this should put me in a relatively safe spot. So this section of the map is the scariest part for me to defend because I'm gonna be moving towards the right side. So I think this will be okay. Um, I'll add on some spore crawlers over here. I don't know if they're gonna fight me in this area at all. Expecto! Attack! Okay. So the cooldown begins even if you don't finish the thing, which is a bit weird. I'm assuming I'll make the Guardians, by the way, out of Brute or out of Mutalisks? Out of Mutate Lisks? Look, I don't know if you're aware, but as far as I know, local shops and third party chains usually have better prices for anything Games Workshop. It's weird, dude. Yes. I um, I find it very strange that if you buy something directly from the original creators, that it's by default more expensive because every other party offers like a 10 to 15% discount on everything. Isn't that a bit funky? Like usually it's the other way around. But for some reason, the Games Workshop stuff, like they do some weird shit at that company, man. I don't quite understand some of their decisions, but it's okay. So from what I understand, in the past, the Games Workshop website had like indicators of what they recommended for each of the colors that you use on each of the models. So they had like an overview guide with the different paints that they recommend. The one of 
They, for some reason, removed that recently. The garrisons are still there. What? <laughs> I didn't even know that that was a feature. Like, I was I was talking to Kalaras about that. He's like, yeah, they used to have that. I'm like, what? That's... That's weird. Why would you remove a very useful feature? Yeah, it's, it's a bit funky. Hey, thank you very much, Anonymous. Appreciate that. Whoever you are. Wait. Oh, no. I lost one of my... I wasn't paying attention at all. Yikes. Okay, fine. I'll pay attention now. I have to go back quite a bit. Yeah, I filled one of the bonus objectives because one of the Phyrophages died. Okay. So I went with that one. I went with that one. And then I went with that. I went with the armor upgrades over here. I went with the spore crawler improvements. Abominations, I don't really care because I've done plan on making them. Okay. Okay. I didn't realize they would actually just bypass everything over here. Thank you very much, Aaron. It's okay, it's okay. But yeah, I've been really enjoying it. I don't really care so much about the Warhammer game itself, but I do think they have created some really nice models. So that's that's where I'm currently at. I don't really care so much about like, you know, I just want to paint them. And they have some nice models. That's for sure. Okay. I should definitely put up static defense everywhere. I feel like I hit supply block so much when I play this. It's because of the Zerklings, I think. So the Zerklings are one supply each. Either that or I'm really bad at the game. Both are reasonable options. I don't even know if they're gonna attack this base. <laughs> no, 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 don't say it. Just whisper sweet lies to me, chat. That's all I want to hear. Don't tell me I'm bad at the game. Where do you start? At the beginning, man. The Dominion has begun venting gas. The infested will die. Expect an attack. Guard our viral phages. Okay, so there's one more over here. Oh, no. Stop it. Stop it. Gentlemen, stop it. Thank you very much, Star O2, man. Star O2. I don't know what O2 is. Anyways, well, I'm assuming it's not oxygen. Maybe it is. Who knows? Maybe it's the year 2002. Did you guys know that people born in the year 2002 are able to vote in elections? Easily. Like, it's not even close. You guys know that? Ooh, Bunny Warren doing a giveaway in the Twitch chat. Very nice. Look, I don't remind us of the passage of time. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to keep all my bases alive here before I start moving out onto the map. Do you guys know that people born in 2006 will be able to vote in 2024 elections? Okay, I'll shut up now. I'll shut up. Okay. I've got myself a solid amount of base defenses. I don't think anything is going to be broken here. Oh, I made way too many drones. Holy crap. 
A couple more spore crawlers over here. And then we'll make mutalisks. And morph them into brood guardians. Did you know that people older than 75 years old can vote? What? Oh, I'm getting wrecked by a liberator. I thought people over the age of 75 were in their prime. The Dominion stopped venting gas. It will take them some time to synthesize more. Prime gaming. Yeah, 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 just like that. Similar type of prime. This section of the map is not nearly as comfortable as I thought it was gonna be. What the heck? I built a whole lot of static defense there. I feel like something is wrong with my selecting here. But it's okay. Okay. So. All of my swarm host dudes, you guys hang out over here in this section of the map, okay? Everybody else, we move in the other direction. I'm making some extra queens so we can put up some more creep tumors. And now the rain begins. <laughs> we have a lot more to make. So this is the Infestor mission, but I haven't had access to these guys yet. Hey, Troy is in back. congratulations! Was I attacking one of my own units? Yeah, I was. I'm not proud of it either. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Bunnyman. Bunny man. Oh my god. <laughs> These guys deal so much damage. I just gotta get more of them, honestly. The only problem is that they don't hit air. But I can make some devourers for that, I guess. That is Hellbats are doing a pretty good job though. Onto the platform. Whee! Very strong. I made a few too many workers. Uh, I do need some um, some detection in this area of the map too, though. Okay. I feel like attacking right now may not be entirely optimal. Don't drag that into the rest of this party. They do seem to spawn a lot of units. Okay, um, I need 250 gas for each Brood Guardian, which is a lot. Maybe I can transfer and resaturate some of this. Yeah, you guys go over here. Defend this facility, men. We are the sword of the Dominion. That's a bit cringe, man. Oh, I like that my Infestors have an anti-air attack. Naturally, they do. Okay. Oh, you guys are not even mining. That's okay, that's okay. Slowly pushing forward. Do I have extra gas yet? 
I can make a couple of my brood guardians. Very good. I'll just fill out whatever else I have with some static defense, I guess. You guys should be pretty powerful here, right? Yeah. Okay. I actually kind of expected my brute lords to just murder everything here, but they're not actually that powerful. I mean, they're powerful, but the garrisons are still there. An infester can replant the Can I um no, cannot target that sadly. The gas has run out, my queen. Our infested have resumed the attack. The gas has run out, my queen. Relatable. Okay. Uh, I keep confusing my Brute Queens with my Guardians, or my, uh, what are they called? Devourers. Yeah, you guys just put up a bunch of... Wait, what? Again? Wait, which one died? My oh my god, I put so much freaking Static Defense over there! Have resumed the attack. Oh my god, yeah, this is right as I lost it. I like that the game always makes a quick save right after you fail an objective. <laughs> no, it wasn't even sport crawlers that I needed, I guess. It's just that the siege tanks do a lot of damage from a distance and I didn't really pay attention to them because there's yes. an entire minimap that's glowing. Yeah, I had so much. This bridge got activated. Okay. The swarm hosts are really powerful. It's just that I don't really want to win every mission just playing Swarm Host, you know? I kind of want to try out my new toys. Okay. You guys go this way. I think it's the siege tank or something that murdered me in that area. But yeah, swarm hosts are amazingly strong in this campaign. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whereabouts? I have no idea, guys. Let's hope it's over here somewhere that I already cleared it. I don't see the red dot. Didn't see a nuke anywhere anyways. It's okay. Oh, it was over here. <laughs> How did it get into my base? Shit, it actually killed all my overlords that were clumped over there. How in the world? There's a freaking... Okay. Completely reasonable. Completely reasonable. How did that ghost even get there? In this facility, men, we are the sword of the Dominion. Okay, I obviously need to get every bonus objective. Because, you know, my ego. You guys get it, right? Okay. It's not even really a question. Okay, we'll save it here, because I'm in a comfortable position now. Prepare to defend our virophages. Okay, I moved you, but you didn't want to move? Okay. That's reasonable. I sense more garrisons across the platform. Let's make it like it never even happened. Get that bridge extended and wipe out that hot. I ah. want the, Zerg off my the guy literally announced that he was going to extend the bridge. Uh, I, for some reason, missed that. Yeah, so this is the push that killed that. Honestly, I think one lurker on the bridge already does a whole lot. Yeah. For some reason, my things don't really seem to kill a lot of stuff, though. Either that or maybe there's just a lot of enemies in general. Okay, guys. Land and then... No? Okay. 
then don't. If you don't want to, that's okay. Okay, obviously I need to get this base going. Let's continue getting some more upgrades. Actually, mm, I think I, I gotta be a little careful here spending all my resources. Mech rowing can sometimes work out poorly for you in this campaign. Just Zerklings alone will probably win all missions, to be honest. These links are insanely powerful. Okay. Okay, get those Vespian geysers going. Um, I'll get some uh, some abominations from there, I guess. Yeah, we'll just flood minerals for now. Bit of a mess, but it should work out in my favor. So gas is going to disappear right now. That would be my cue to attack, but obviously we do it in reverse. The gas has run out, my queen. Our infested have resumed the attack. Okay. Um, we'll make some abominations from there. There's one extra gas guy, sir. Whoa, is he just mining my base right now? Find that a little toxic. I still haven't captured that one, but I think that's okay. We'll just keep clearing the map. There's a base up here that I haven't yet gone after. Oh, drop over here. Completing bonus objectives will increase your power. Nuclear strike over here, but I think that that ghost is gone at this point. Good. Looks like my push over here, or that push over here has been... What? Did it just drop a bunch of medics out of a freaking overlord and now the medics are healing the overlord that they got dropped out of? Strange sequence of events, man. Very weird. I don't even know if that's legal. Okay, let's save it. And we'll start moving a little bit in this direction, I guess. Yeah. I need some creep across this bridge. So if you guys could put down some tumors in this area, that'd be nice. Yo, Mr. Wardy! Thank you very much for the raid, dude. Hope you had a good stream. For those of you from Wardy's channel, I am currently playing the Enhanced Swarm Campaign. Which is basically a campaign with enhanced Zerg units. But it's based on the Nightmare difficulty. So it's not brutal difficulty, it's Nightmare difficulty. Which is a custom campaign made above that. So Kerrigan is disabled in every mission. She is not around. And... It's a lot of fun. I mean, the opponent just went for a Overlord drop. With a bunch of medics inside of it. I have never seen that before. But, yeah. I have a bunch of Brute Lords over here that have, like, a bombardment ability. Which I really like. Uh, did I get this base up and running? Yes. I have an infested base, too. I am aware of that. Ooh, push over here. I want to try and take this, but I guess I can't. Okay, you guys please take that. Good. There's one medic over there, or one medevac, but that should be okay. Um, one of my bonus objectives is to not lose any of those points. It's very swarmy. Okay, you guys please continue over here. Drop up there. Oh, my base actually disappeared in that section of the map. Is 
We'll aim for that thing up north. Should spawn quite a few units. So this is actually the part in the mission where I don't think you're supposed to be attacking, but... Ooh, 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 careful. Oh, I can't, I can't make them switch sides. Can I fungal you guys? Oh my god. The fungal in this campaign is a little stronger. Pushing the creep. I will try and transfer you guys over in this direction. Okay. The gas. Oh shit, you got. Didn't I rally you guys the other way? Love that. This is so chaotic, though. We'll make a couple of spines in that area. Because I keep getting attacked. Get some additional drops over here. Maybe I can make some of those Banelink shooter things. I do like the Banelinks. They're just a bit expensive and not very cost efficient, I don't think, but... Okay. Oh. Ooh. Hello? Okay. That was a little sketchy, but we, we made it. Uh, I actually don't know if I still have any of the unclean ones. Ooh, computer's dying right now? Yeah, I don't know. I need a couple of unclean ones to activate the objective points. Can make some abominations over here. Keep going. The entrance is within our grasp. Okay. You go grab that one, please. We'll try and take down this base. The ability is very slow to activate, but once it does, it's very strong. Okay, I'll be taking this base if you don't mind me. And I think there's one objective point right across... Wait. Oh, it's right over here, but there's not a bridge. Huh. These bridges are in different locations. Yeah. So this one requires me to put a creep tumor over there. Creep tumor come out of the Brute Queens. And I guess we'll continue across this bridge, but... <laughs> Very reasonable ability. Okay. Uh, I still have some missile upgrades that I can get. I think that's all right. Gonna move you over there. This base over there is active right now. Ah, I'm running out of out of resources here, though, slowly but surely. I'm gonna allow you to take this one too, but it's gas is once again venting onto the platform. It's a bit risky. Because I can't really protect everything in one go. But if I survive the next three minutes, life should be relatively doable. You wanna leave, Milo? Or are you just gonna reposition? Okay. What are you doing? There's an SCV moving in this direction. <laughs> okay. Hey, buddy. There's a cat on my desk. Makes the game a little trickier to play, but it's okay. Hey, buddy. You want to say hello to the chat? You want to say hello to the stream? Oh. oh, big boy. Big boy cat. This is not Toby. This is Milo. Looking handsome, man. Oh, you're looking handsome. Yeah. All right. I'll put you back. Sorry. 
Didn't mean to interrupt your very important business. Disrespectful. Disrespectful of me to even touch him, to be honest. You wanna leave? All right. How dare I? Yeah, he's got a lot of important business to take care of, man. Like, uh, creeping on the neighbors. That sort of thing. Hey, thank you very much, Pancake Master, for the 55 months. I'm pretty sure Milo considers me to do a terrible job at guarding my home. Yeah. The Dominion destroyed one of our viral phages. No! Ah, I blame Milo for that one. I cannot lose the Virophage, any of them, even though it's super messy for the bonus objectives. Oh my god. What? They were attacking it for that long and I didn't even notice? Don't tell me I'm gonna lose this freaking thing to two fire bets and a marine. Okay, I <laughs> I got it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Splits? <laughs> it died before it... Anyways, that's irrelevant. Don't even try. I should not have taken this thing, dude. Oh, there's one Benchy murdering me. Fuck me. I shouldn't be taking any of these objective points. It's actually kind of funny. Like, some of those objective points are genuinely worse to take because it makes the map harder. Funny how that works. Because it gives me more targets that I need to defend. The fungal button is also in a different location than it normally is, which is a bit annoying. I guess it's because it's not fungal. Dude, there's actually so many units! I've got a million gas, but no... Do I still have income? I do still have decent income, I guess. I think these swarm lurkers are just basically the way to go in every mission. If you're struggling, the swarm lurkers are insane. Let's burn this place before they come okay, we'll save it here. But again. Yeah, this mission's really fun, but very chaotic though. I made tons of static defense. I think I'm gonna just move some of it forward. Because a lot of these bases are now no longer... oh god. I don't think they're gonna be dropping my outer, like my, my further backwards bases, right? At least you'd imagine they don't. I don't know. There's still two dropper lords over here. The Terrans have run out. Okay. They've run out of gas. That's good. Can we make some more, um, mutalists here? So I can make some more of those big boys. So this is another one of those bases that I need to take care of. I like how there's liberators here taking care of everything. Together with Zerk. Kind of a powerful combination. Okay. In the meantime, my uh, swarmy stuff is going in the other direction. That is usually the way that this map goes. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I apparently took that base as my own. Oh shit! 
There's a pride of August grad. Back off, retreat. Um, I'm gonna need some devourers. Yeah, let's make some. Um... Oh, I'm supply blocked because I'm maxed. Uh, okay, I guess we just try and fight it. I don't know what the build order here is. Dude, there's a gigantic freaking battle cruiser defending that base, and I'm max, so I can't actually do anything with it. I can take this base, the science facility. That's nice, I guess. I will just attack move into that Terran base. What about that? Or Terran base? Honestly, hard to say what it is. Take everything. This is kind of a risky fight, but... Why did I move my Mutas? I could have blinked them. The Silly mistake. Why didn't I consider that? Okay. Looks like the Pride of August Grad is dead. I'll rain a couple more bombardments from the sky. Okay. Hopefully I can still overwhelm this. I have an awful lot of units here. As long as I have detection, I think I should be good. I'll send my reinforcements in that direction. This base, I currently have absolutely no static defense on at all. Which feels kind of dumb. Um, so I guess I'll send a couple of spine crawlers just like that. Such a delayed fight, but... Like, that ability is super slow. That's a full golden base, though. My minerals on the right side of the map are starting to run out, so taking that base would actually maybe even be a necessity. Because I'm sure that final objective will be quite well protected. 